Hello, hello, heathens. Welcome back to the channel. Welcome to an art video. It has been ages since I have uploaded an illustration video, right? Those of you who are here for my illustration have probably been crossing your arms, stomping your little feet, wondering, yes, I said feet, feet, not feet, feet. Stomping your feet, crossing your arms, wondering, girl, hello what what is with all of these random uploads and these the, the, these weird vibes that you've been exuding i know yes if you watched my previous videos not necessarily the diamond painting that i uploaded but a couple videos back you know that i've been a little bit well no not a little bit here i am sugarcoating things i have been significantly off my groove since truthfully about this time last year we won't get into all of the details if you've been along for my ride you know last summer was just i was essentially out of commission in terms of artwork because of an injury and it was just a big old thing and it's a chronic injury it's not going to go away but that injury resulted in i mean i basically it put the fear of all of the gods goddesses and demons in me for many reasons, you know, I'm an illustrator and when you have an injury that prevents you from doing what you do, it, 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 it tends to rock you a little bit. And that compounded with a lot of issues with nine to five, the whole nine to five situation. It was just, it's just been a lot and I have not been feeling steady for about a year. Now that being said, I'm not one to cower in a corner when I feel that the walls are closing in on me, I spring into action. That is definitely one of my superpowers which i am eternally grateful for you know i'm not when i'm knocked down i don't stay there right i i'm scrappy that way i'm a fighter so even though your girl has been off her groove for about a year i am beginning to steady myself a little bit we're not completely on you know a straight and narrow path here i mean it's my life when am i ever but just know that when things are off it's only a matter of time before i I steady myself and we get back on our little our little groovy train right just imagine me in my funky 70s 80s disco outfit just dodging dodging poop bullets while I'm on the dance floor right it's it that's that's basically my life but let's get into today's video so for those of you who are here for illustration videos I hope that you enjoy watching this one and this is going to be a little bit of a catch-up session to let everybody know what I'm up to, what I'm planning, and kind of an explanation on why my YouTube content has been a little all over the place. If I sound a little scratchy, it's because it's early this morning and I was out last night and speaking rather loudly, so there you go. But this illustration that you see me working on today is one of the 5x7s that have been basically the, the meat and potatoes of my illustration in recent months. Every time I have some spare time, I pull out a five by seven sheet, some markers, some watercolors, some pens, and voila, out pops a piece. The art supplies that I use, if you are new to my channel, will always be listed down below in all of my videos. If by some, I don't know, some act of God, some natural disaster, I ever forget to list the supplies down below, just let me know, leave me a comment, and I will let you know what I use, but the list of the art supplies will be down below as well as the amazon links none of the supplies i use are amazon exclusives feel free to shop wherever but that will be down there links to my social media my patreon my website everything you need to know always down below but let's go ahead and chit chat i mean there's nothing to speak of technique wise you guys have seen my techniques over and over you've seen me illustrate didn't do anything new on this piece Today, as I mentioned, is simply more of a just hang out, chill out, let's let's chit chat about what I'm up to. So, oh, and this piece, by the time this video is up, she will be available in my Etsy shop if you are interested in scooping her up. Okay? Again, links, all of that down below. So what have I been up to? What have I been up to all year? The year, you guys, we are already halfway done. What? What? No. If I was prone to panicking, I would be panicking right about now. I have been working on plenty of work. I simply have not been sharing it on YouTube or by extension on Instagram. 
Reasons being, a lot of it has been just private sketchbook work. Some of it has been product development work. And other artwork has been cue the choir of angels or um, demons, whatever your flavor is. Just cue the choir, cue the choir. My next coloring book is complete, at least the interior. I have not completed the cover designing yet, but my next book is done. Now for the colorists in the house, you're thinking, whoa, whoa girl, rein it in, rein it in. You released Rococo Agogo way back in March and you have not given us any color and chat videos. I know, I know. I promise you, I will have at least one color and chat for Rococo Agogo out before my new book is released. At least one, I promise you. I've not forgotten that book. I love her. I've simply been, as I said, off my groove and I've been pulled in a million different directions and I've been having a damn time attempting to organize my time. There are periods when I do so well. I parse my day down, you know, by the hour and I do excellent, but sometimes, sometimes somebody throws a rock in the spokes and again, I get a little wobbly. I get a little wobbly and I have difficulty organizing myself. I don't have anyone around me to wrangle me in, you know, to rope me in and be like, Carla, listen girl, you are going to lose it, you are losing it, relax and do this, 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 and this, right? I'm, I am that person for myself and I'm not the greatest at it sometimes, but I have been working on artwork. My next book is complete. And I, I mean, that's honestly why I haven't been sharing my work. Some of it is private, some of it is product development, and other, it's a new coloring book. I can't share that. I have also started a new brand, as if I needed anything else on my plate. But here's the thing. If you've been watching my videos and keeping up with me, Recently, I have been, <laughs> whether it's a blessing or a curse, well, we've yet to find out, but I have been given more time to pursue my creative pursuits because I had, you know, just the nine to five thing. I have nothing against nine to five grinds. If that's what you're into, that's what you're into. But I basically had to let that go. Because I was tired of being told, not, oh, I'm being, you know, I'm tired of being told what to do, which is true, but basically, long story longer, <laughs> I was placed in situations where my work was being appreciated, but I was being underpaid, and I was basically being told that I'm too much. Too much personality, you're too weird, your clothing is just, mm, you know, some of our clients are a little conservative, so if you can tone it down, no. Again, long story longer, basically, once again, I was put in a position where I was too much. And this time, this time I had to build the resolve to say, either I'm going to walk away and say, F you, I'm not going to temper myself for your delicate sensibilities for a paycheck, a measly paycheck at that, or I'm just going to say, Carla, just be an adult be a boring adult and acquiesce a little bit for the sake of stability, right? So I, I was on that teeter-totter of, F you, I'm burning my bridges, I'm tired of this shit, or, all right, I'll tone it down a little bit because it's nice having a steady paycheck. So yeah, that's what happened. Well, needless to say, that part of my life is essentially over, and now I have free time to start another brand, a brand in which I am the boss. It is fabulous. It is scary. And if you follow me on Instagram, you've already seen me teasing that brand. But for that brand, I am producing a ton of artwork. I'm going to be opening my very own online store towards the end of the year. So that is my big project for 2022. And that has been taking up a lot of my time and a lot of my money. Let me tell you, starting a brand is scary. But new products or rather new product artwork new coloring book new brand and my first licensed artwork my first licensed illustration that happened that happened this year the the diamond painting yes 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 
the diamond painting. That was a big thing. That has been in the works for over a year, and she's finally here. Diamond painting videos will be coming to my channel. They've already started. Actually, I uploaded the first one not too long ago, and by the time this is up, the second one is very likely to be up as well. But yeah, you, you do you see what I mean? That my life has just been... Oh, the fact that I can study myself to film this voiceover early in the morning while the birds are out there chirping, I'm calm, cool, well, I was going to say calm, cool, and collected. I don't know about collected, but I'm cool, relatively calm, sipping my coffee, listening to the birds chirp outside, and I'm chit-chatting with you all. So I would say I'm doing, I'm doing all right. And I think at this point, I'm ready to begin <laughs> re-steadying my schedule, meaning we're, we're going to attempt to get back into my groove of parsing my day down by the hour and hopefully hopefully i'm feeling as though i'm i'm on the path to standing steady again i'm no longer dodging those poop bullets on the dance floor well i still am but it's not the barrage of shit bombs <laughs> that it's been for the past what year okay so we're feeling better you know unfortunately as long as I like to think that I'm, you know, super monster of the universe. No, no, no. I'm, I'm, I am I'm, still get a little wobbly. I still get a little wobbly. And I, I'm self-aware enough to admit that. I'm not so full of hubris that I think I can handle everything with finesse, right? I can finesse my way in, out, and through situations, but I'm not all that smooth all the time. And if you're not, it's okay. It's okay. Because even, even this monster, right? Even this desert spook that you've all come to know and love, even I wobble, okay? So if you wobble too, that's all right. So with all of that being said, I'm dealing with a lot. A lot of good stuff, a little bit of bad stuff. I think that the good is finally beginning to overtake the bad, which is great. So with that being said, I'm going to get on with the rest of my day. I hope that you enjoyed this video. I hope that this little catch-up session gave you a little bit of insight as to why I've been so scattered and just so infrequent with my posts and a little cryptic with the posts that I do post, but I'm, I'm going to try to get back into the groove within the next couple of weeks and then it's going to be, you know, perfect, glittery, yummy Carla sauce for the rest of the year. But all of that being said, if you are interested in following my shenanigans with my new brand, please, by all means, go follow me on Instagram. I will be posting a lot more frequently when the launch date gets a little closer. Just know it's going to be my own little universe that I'm creating without any rules, without anybody telling me what to do. And that includes places like Etsy, right? I'm opening my own online store. My rules, baby. My planet, my rules. No, I'm not leaving Etsy, by the way. I, I am absolutely not leaving Etsy. This, is, this new brand is an entirely new animal. But again, we'll talk about that later. New coloring book new brands, my first licensed diamond painting. It's a lot. It's a lot. Take a look down below. Everything you need to know will be down below. Links to where you can find me online, my Etsy shop, my socials, my Patreon, all that good stuff. Take a peep down below. Be bad. Be good. I do not give a damn which. Pick one and run with it. Just make sure that you come back in one piece. All right? I will see you again in the next one, my nasties.